All right, our next step is to encapsulate. And we use Flygar 184. This is a product specially made for solar panels. Uh, you can find it on eBay. It's about $54 um, a container. And you want to use one container per panel. The encapsulant stays 100% optically clear. Uh, like I said, this system will last for decades. Um, it glues the cell to the glass. It actually flows under the cell and gets between the cell and the glass and covers the back. And uh, it offers protection. And if you think you need some more protection on the back side, you can add a sheet of Tedlar, uh, T E D L A R. It's also on the internet. It's fairly inexpensive. To cover this one, you're looking at about $12. Uh, I personally don't need them for my array. By the time I mount it to my system, there's nothing underneath that's going to hurt it. This protects it well enough from bugs and temperature. And so it comes like this. It's kind of the, the consistency of syrup. And you just take it and you pour the whole bottle in there. And you have to mix this for about five minutes slowly. You don't want to whip in air. And you have about two hours. To play with this stuff so don't get in a hurry and, and rush it and we pour it a certain way I try to pour where I'm only pouring around three sides of the cell instead of all four to chase the air bubble out that gets, can get trapped under the cell in the glass so we're going to shut it off just a second and let me mix this for five minutes and then we'll be back